goddamn button. Press the goddamn button. Yo, 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 this is Games and Graphics. We're back in the building with another GTA 5 mod tutorial for you. And today we are going to be installing a Y map on our 5M server, okay? So let's go ahead and jump right into the requirements. First requirement, which is the major requirement you need, is 5M. That's why I have it on this download page right here. You have to download and install 5M first. I will leave a link down in the description to a video showing you how to download and install 5M and create your own server. So make sure you go check that out if you do not have 5M installed, okay? Once you got that installed, you can come back to this video and you want to click on this link that will lead you to Final Fantasy um, XV, okay? I believe that's 15, all right? Final Fantasy 15 Galden Quay. Okay, this is a 5M map as well as a regular map that you can install inside of single player. Okay, but today we are going to be installing the Y map inside of 5M. Okay, so once you get to this link, scroll down and always read the description that the author has provided for you before you install or download any script or mod. All right, go ahead and check out this information. Once you have finished reading this, what you want to do is come over here to the 1.0 current and you want to select the green arrow. All right, you want to go ahead and download this white map. Okay, once you have this downloaded right here. It should look something like this on my left hand side. I have a folder with just Final Fantasy 15 that we just downloaded. Okay, it's going to look just like this as soon as you download it. And then on my right hand side, I have my 5M server opened up. Okay, this is my server um, area right here. Okay, this is where I have my resource folder at and my, uh, my server CFG file as well. Okay. So let's go back to our downloads and let's go ahead and open up Final Fantasy folder, okay? Once you're inside that folder, there's going to be three more folders and there's going to be a OIV file with a readme, okay? What we are going to need for this tutorial only is the 5M folder. So let's go ahead and open up the 5M folder. Inside that 5M folder is going to be our add-on map for... Um, 5M server okay if you go ahead and select this and open it up inside that folder is going to have another folder and a resource Lua file if you select stream folder and open that up inside of this stream folder is going to have all of our house files okay this is going to be all the necessary files that we need in order to stream our house on our 5M server okay so let's go back and go back again now you want to make sure that you're right inside your 5M folder and, and you're looking at Lafa 2K Final Fantasy XV, okay? You want to be looking at this folder right here. And you want to go back over to your server, 5M server, and you want to open up resources, okay? Open up your resource folder. And inside this resource folder is where we are going to be dragging and dropping our Lafa 2K Final Fantasy folder, okay? So as you can see, I'm just gonna grab this whole folder right here, drag and drop it right here into the 5M server inside my resource folder, okay? Drag and drop, and you should see it right there in your resource folder, okay? Now from this point, what we wanna do is just go ahead and highlight the name. You wanna highlight the name and copy it, okay? Now what we want to do is add this name to our server, okay? So go ahead and find your server. Either you could go uh, back to your 5M uh, server right here and scroll down and select server CFG file, okay? Or you could uh, go ahead and use your um, Infinic Infinitus program if you have it. That's what I'm going to use right now. So go ahead and open up your server and inside your server, you always want to go down to where your resources are at. We can go down to the bottom of the list of our resources. And let's go ahead and type in start and space. And then paste the name of the folder that we just added on to our server, which is Lafa2K underscore Final Fantasy XV. Okay. Once you have that added and it looks just like this, start in the name, you want to go ahead and save, okay? 
once you click save we have successfully installed it so for right now all we need to do is go ahead and run our server okay All right, once you spawn into 5M, what you want to do is make your way over towards the beach. Okay, uh, make your way over towards the beach. And when you're at the beach, you want to come right over here where I'm at. Okay, this is where our Final Fantasy location is going to be at. Okay, it's going to be right over here on this side of the beach. All right, go ahead and teleport over there. Get everything time to load up as it is going to be a lot of objects, but everything will be here. Okay. As you can see, when I, um, the place I picked on the map will lead you directly over here. When you come over here, you're going to see a sign that says Gouding Quay. Okay. That will let you know you're here. Um, let me open up this real quick. Um, F9. I'll open up mine. There we go. All right, just to give you a bird's eye view of kind of where it's going to be at. So it's going to be on this side of the beach, like I said, and you're going to see um, just pretty much right here. All right, it'll be like a little hut out there, and it'll be a dock you could walk onto all the way out there. Okay, and it's also going to be a black yacht at the end. Okay, this is like your party boat right there. All right, so let's do a little quick little walk through real quick. Um, boom. All right, let's do that. And we are going to need something to get down here a little quicker. Let's take one of these bikes. Okay. Now, if you started and it's a little bit laggy, go ahead and just uh, reset your PC. Just restart your PC, not reset, but restart your PC, and um, that should fix the lagginess. Okay. Because, uh, like I said, this um, it uploads a lot of objects. It's pretty huge. All right. Well, now I might want to bring that also in the back. So this is the little eating area. Then right here, you have uh, you have the little eating area, the dining area also. They got some uh, nice little you know benches and stuff like that here. It's gonna have people. It's gonna be populated. Um, we got the bar right here in the middle. Um, let me show you on the sides over here. You have rooms like this one is a two bedroom right here. And uh, you can't go out that door or in that door. Um, and on the other side. Watch where you walk, you idiot. <laughs> okay. And on this side, we have another room um, with a bed in it. Yeah. You like it rough, Pretty baby? tight. Um, and in here, you could go in here, and this is the bathroom. Okay. You got your sink, toilet, and bath. All right. And let's continue with this little short mini tour jump back on my bike all right now if you continue with me down here this is the little lounge area the atmosphere in the city they got some Whatever. more tables and stuff where people could dine at um, nice little scenery and stuff like that all right without further ado we have our I probably shouldn't have took the bike down the stairs but <laughs> it's okay back down here we have our party boat all right this right here lights up at night time uh, let's go ahead and make it night real quick if we don't oh, I don't think we can fast forward. No, we can't Nope Nope. In order to see it at night, you're gonna have to wait till it's night on the server. I don't think we could fast forward the uh, The time while on our servers only the weather that we could affect All right. So when you go up here, you're going to see a little bar area on the side and you are going to have uh, probably some music playing. I have my music turned off right now for copyright reasons and stuff. But uh, like you see, we have the lights, we have some microphones and we have some turntables. So everything's all set up for role playing. You know what I mean? If you want to be back here DJing and stuff and have some people performing, it's all good. You got everything all set up for you. All right. 
and to get out you can go all the way around the boat they got the hot tub with water in it and stuff you know so uh, feel free to check that out it's a big ass boat same like the other yachts and uh, that's pretty much it so this one is like an easy install you know what I mean like uh, the author already placed everything in a folder for you you just have to uh, throw the folder in your resource folder and then after that what you will have to do is um, add the name to your search and that's it Right, he's actually. I was about to give you. I was just okay. All right, he actually made it up all the way with the bike. <laughs> well, if this video helped y'all out to install it, or if you just enjoyed the video, oh, hold on, let me hold my ending speech. Let me show you the bottom. Okay, they got a bottom part also down there with some chairs and tables and stuff. Hey, sweet thing. Oh, oh excuse me, I'm just squeezing by. <laughs> all right, there we go. Before I begin with my outro, let me show y'all what's down here. Alright, I don't think we'll be able to get back up doing that. Alright. Okay, if you come down these stairs like I just showed, you're going to have a little nice little area out here. You know what I mean? It's going to be lit up at night also. You got a fire already down here burning with some chairs, tables, and umbrellas and stuff. You know what I mean? Alright, you also got a nice little dock out here with some boats and jet skis, you know? It's pretty much cool right here. That's a nice little boat. Looks like a little yacht or something. But yeah, so uh, I guess it's time for our little outro. If you enjoyed the video, or if this helped you out to install it, make sure that you smash that like button for your boy. And definitely subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And share the video with your friends that are in the modding GTA 5 and 5M servers, okay? This is Games and Graphics. I am out of here. Till next time. I ain't scared of you motherfuckers.